Well, these images show the conditions 86 people were in a cold trailer and they were locked inside the trailer you see there. Channel 5's Trace and Bragg explains how they attempted to get out to save themselves. Oscar, that tractor trailer was stopped by a DPS trooper in Willacy County. We now know that the youngest person found in that trailer was three years old. Tonight, Border Patrol says they are looking closer at a hole in the top of the trailer's roof. This is a look at the scene from last night. The 86 individuals were found hiding behind rotten fruit you see here. Today we learned from authorities that cold rather than hot temperatures was the issue inside the trailer discovered. Last night, the trailer was a refrigerated unit. They tell us the temperature was set at 40 degrees. Border Patrol Sector Chief Manny Padilla says preliminary evidence shows that the 86 people inside the trailer may have been trying to fight their way out. They made a hole on the roof of this uh, trailer and um, based on the uh, based on the uh, temperature inside the trailer, it looks like it was uh, an attempt at escape route. Here's a look at the hole that Padilla was referring to. Padilla says last November, a multi-agency operation known as Operation Big Rig was created to curb what Border Patrol calls an increase in these types of smuggling events. Last July, 10th people or 10 people were found dead in a tractor trailer parked in a Walmart parking lot. They lost their lives due to complications from heat exposure. The driver of that big rig was convicted and sentenced to life behind bars. Last night, two of the 86 people found in the back of the tractor trailer had to be rushed to the hospital due to complications from dehydration. The driver and a passenger were taken into custody. In the studio, Trace and Brad, Channel 5 News at 10.